Good morning, welcome back to another vlog. It seems I'm doing things a bit different this week because it's currently Tuesday, not Monday. <laughs> because yesterday I kind of had a funk. So I woke up, I made waffle waffles and I ate waffles for three hours and watched documentaries lying on the sofa. And then around one I was like, maybe I should do something because I feel really bad. And <laughs> I pretty much had to um, go on a run slash walk in the sun because it was really nice and sunny. Uh, just to wake up a little bit and then uh, I had a call with my dad which was Snowcat Prince related. I think that's the, our last kind of official call. I think I'm just going to do it now. And then I started streaming. So I streamed for three and a half hours I think. And it was really good because I have started cleaning up the Snowcat Prince pages. Um, when I left you last time I just did a short like little test page but then I streamed again and I well ended up doing <laughs> two more <laughs> so there are bigger pages as well they're not that e as simple as the previous one so I'll, I don't think I'll show it because it's more of a patreon only kind of thing <laughs> but I might show some panels because it's always fun or maybe some process some drawing I don't know we'll see um other things that were different today, uh, this morning at least, was that yesterday, since I was so tired, uh, it took me so long to get up from bed, <laughs> and that's kind of what messed up my day. Uh, my dad suggested that I wake, when I wake up the first time in the morning, I get up. So, something that I've done the last few weeks, I think I mentioned it before, is that I sleep in until my boyfriend gets up. And I kind of, just kind of allow myself to wake up slowly that way without an alarm because I hate alarm clocks. Um, and I did that for a while until I kind of felt like I couldn't get up anymore even though it was late and I slept a long time. Uh, but in that like spirit period, like even though I wake up when he wakes up, I also wake up a little bit earlier to close the window. So it's like an automatic response when <laughs> when the heating turns off on in the house. I get up and I close the window so that we don't like lose heat while having the window open and heating the house. So I do that and that's like an automatic, like it happens at one point in the morning. <laughs> so usually it happens around 7 but today it happened around 6. So I was like, oh well. I woke up for this, so I'll try and wake up. It took me quite a t some time on my phone just to wake up. So I was up at 6 a.m. And I feel alright. I feel kind of tired now, but I'm, that's probably just because I'm hungry. But I had a coffee. I pretty much did everything that I needed to do yesterday, today. So I sent off uh, both the postcard and the trading card for print. I... Finish editing editing, uh, editing the vlog and uploading that. So that's one day late, but it's okay, it's a vlog. And then... Oh, I packaged all the orders and shipped them. So they're out of the way of that as well. And I think that was about... And I do need to do a tutorial, but I don't know if I'll do it today. Um, it's not really day specific, the tutorial. Let me just see what I've done before. Also yesterday we rolled over $1,300 on my Patreon and I don't know how to react. It's kind of crazy. Um, let's see. Posted the previous one exactly a month ago. So that's cool. I think I'll do that tomorrow because today I just kind of feel like uh, working on Snowcat prints and doing the pages for that. Um, so I've done pretty much everything here. I've done that, done that, done that. And I will put tutorial on tomorrow. Oh, we're getting food today. <laughs> I totally was like, was that yesterday or today? So we get food delivered. And I was like, was that yesterday? Did it not get delivered? No, no, it's coming today. It's just my morning has been a lot longer than it usually is. It's 9 a.m. right now. And I don't usually start working until 9.30, so I'm very far ahead today because I got up at 6. Um, I have a feeling it's going to smack me in the face, though, when I 
uh, later today. I feel like I'm gonna be super sleepy, but who knows? I think maybe I'll research a little bit um, where to print Snoka prints because um, my inspiration is pretty much for Gorillax and for Snoka prints when it comes to. Well, Gorillax was different. I went with something different for Gorillax, but for the Snoka prints, I wanna. I like these books. So this is this is Hiko T and Nightlight. If you want a really cute comic to read, these ones are super cute. This one's a, this one's the first one. This one's the second one. Um, and I didn't think there would be a second one, so I'm very happy that there is. And it came out just this month. So I really like the big A4 pages. So all the art and everything is is A4. Um, and it's hardcover and it has this really nice texture like fabric here. A lot of the no brow books have this. I don't really care that much for that but it would be cool. I just like the hardcover big book. It just feels really nice especially since um, Snowcat is going to be so big. It probably is better to have it hardcover um, but it will make it a little bit more expensive so I need to look into it. I need to figure out how many pages these are. Because I think maybe Snoka Prince is this, like both of them together. <laughs> I think it's pretty big. See, I'm going to research a little bit and see what to do. But I'm pretty sure I'm just going to end up drawing Snoka Prince today. Um, after I have something to eat, I think I'll have a waffle. A good, good Norwegian tradition is to make waffle mixture the day before, put it in a milk carton and you just have it in the fridge and you can just continue eating it throughout the week. <laughs> I don't know how long it keeps. A few days is definitely alright. But yeah. Yeah, I'm gonna see if I can find anywhere to print the Snooka prints. Okay, so I've roughly counted the pages and I'm pretty sure it's 50. So actually, Snowcat is actually going to be this big. <laughs> well, excluding the covers in between. But yeah, whoops, <laughs> it's gonna be a big book. Yes, best breakfast ever. I knew it was gonna hit me. <laughs> so it's 10.30 uh, and I'm pretty damn tired at this point. I've actually spent the last half an hour to just write a bunch of um, Instagram posts because I have been so bad at posting on Instagram. And like, there's no reason for it because I've done so much art, like I always post on YouTube, like YouTube is the one I probably stick to the most, and like, surprisingly. And just after I started Patreon, I've just been very loose, <laughs> I don't know, very um, unorganized when it comes to Instagram. So I did post one, and I have four other... Um, drafts so now I can just click on it and post it whenever I want so hopefully I can do that soon um, I just wish there was an option for scheduling posts on Instagram I know there's different apps and, and different websites that do it for you but I'm not gonna I'm not, I'm not that butter, bothered by it I just need to write a bunch of posts and just <laughs> remember to post it anyway I think this room is a mess, but I don't want to care. I think I'll just go live. Do some snow cut prints, finish that page that I worked on yesterday. Well, no, not yesterday. Oh, no, yesterday. <laughs> I can't even remember when that went live. Isn't that crazy? So if you want to see me work on the snow cut prints pages, I would recommend going over to to Twitch, um, I will just film a little bit of my screen when I do film, well I do start streaming and do start working today, just to give you guys something to see. Um, I was watching um, Bailey J's vlogs yesterday and she was talking about how she doesn't really care about the montages as long as people just talk about everything and nothing and I totally agree, that's what I watch as well. I just like having stuff in the background or just watching it before I go to sleep or just like to zone out and not care. Like when you watch documentary and stuff, you kind of have to focus and be aware of what's happening. But if you just watch vlogs where people are just talking about their life and their day, it's just really chill. I like it. 
So this is the um, page that I'm working on con uh, currently. So this is the first page with Kit. So it took me a while to get Kit right, but hopefully it will be fine the next few panels. Um, yeah, no, it's really fun. I don't know if I'll just do the lines and then move over to the other one and do the lines for that one, but we'll see. Say hi to the vlog! <laughs> hey! <laughs> hi vlog! <laughs> You'll be famous now! You'll be famous guys! You will be famous! Oh my god! Isa still got the first! Oh my god! <laughs> I've been streaming for like an hour! <laughs> hey! Okay. Okay, I think... That's it. Okay, bye. Lots of love and everyone in the vlog. Yay! Show us a fame. <laughs> <laughs> All right, it's quite a lot later now. I think I feel a little bit of me streaming. Uh, I'm gonna put some clips in from this actual stream as well because it'll be <laughs> it will show more of what I did. So right now it's uh, 4 p.m. I'm gonna post my vlog so people can get that. Uh, but yeah, I'm just kind of looking through different prices for books and stuff, for hardcover books, because I didn't really look at that before when I said I would, I just started streaming instead. Um, but I might start messaging around and see how much printing would start cost and, and all that that I need to figure out at some point anyway. Um, but I did all the lines and the flat color for the page I was working on and also I'll show you. Yeah. So I've done. This is the one that you saw earlier. So I did all the rough, well, all the lines and the 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 base color for everything. Didn't do the backgrounds just for now because I don't know. I got lazy, um, and I wanted to do more, more lines. So I did start on the next page, which these guys are in. Ta da! And I, I think it's fun. Um, I just needed the break. I. I streamed for like four hours, so that was quite plenty enough. I might, I don't know, have a break and then just go back to streaming? I don't know yet. Um, we'll see. See how I feel later. But right now I'm just gonna look through things, post my vlog and, and look through things um, for printing. Um, and then I'll see what I need to do. Uh, I'm not gonna do the tutorial today. I'm gonna do that tomorrow morning, I think. Uh, because I need to do that in the morning and not in the evening. And anyway, I've been working for quite some time now. I started around 7, so <laughs> that's uh, a while ago. And I got up real early. Real, real early. <laughs> so yeah, I'm going to look through some uh, pricings and stuff and I'll see what happens. Uh, I just have a feeling this vlog is going to be weird. I don't know, we'll see tomorrow. See what I uh, end up doing tomorrow. Uh, it's just not that much stuff that I need to do other than working on my comic this week. So, Good morning, you might hear my boyfriend showering in the background. That's just because I don't want to wait with starting the vlog again because um, by losing Monday I lost a lot of time to film or time to do stuff. Uh, so I will see what I come up with for the end of the vlog, just to fill it out a little bit. But today, the first thing on the agenda is to do a Patreon tutorial, which is pretty fun. Anyway, uh, I'm just going to make sure that everything's set up properly, like my sound and everything. Because <laughs> the last few times it's just been a mess. Um, but I think the one that I won was how I do animal anatomy and how I pose animals and how I think. So that's going to be really fun. And um, it's just, it, it's kind of like similar to Draw With Me, just that I try and teach. So I call it Learn With Me. <laughs> it's just a lot easier for me to just sit down and try and explain it than having a um, set kind of step by step process. So um, <clears throat> I woke up. Uh, I woke up at 7 today. Uh, my I'm trying to get up when my body wants to get up. And today that was 7 and not 6, luckily for me. Um, 
<laughs> so I, I still feel tired though, so hopefully my, my coffee will help. Uh, and then yeah, probably we'll stream later after the tutorial and then tomorrow, it's Wednesday, right? I thought it was Thursday. That's good. I have one more extra day. Uh, yeah, and then I will do the Friday video tomorrow. I think what I'll do is um, a few draw this in your styles, actually, because I found some that I like. And I would like to do it. I just feel like doing some um, watercolor after all this digital stuff that I've been doing. <laughs> And also, I posted a vlog yesterday, and you guys are amazing, and you're all saying how much you love the vlogs, and that makes me super, super happy. And and that vlog is actually doing better than the previous ones, and I think that's because I've updated how I do my thumbnails now. So you can see the, not last one, but the previous one before that, um, I just took took the picture of the kettle, kettle well, cup kitten cup, and I just... Uh, put that there and put studio vlog. I think that's a lot more enticing to click on than my face So as long as I draw something and and that's in the picture people will click on that Which is what I need to happen. So that was great. Thank you guys so much for being amazing people I tried to reply to some comments, but I read all of them just so you guys know I just can't reply to all of them. So anyway, I'm gonna I'm gonna I'm actually gonna find my Kettle Cats um, poem because people were excited about that and I'm like, yeah. And I know my wrote, actually when I was trying to write Snow Cat Prince, I ended up trying to write some Kettle Cats. So I know I have it somewhere, I just have to find it. I found the the Kettle Cat seat, like, um, the Kettle Cat poems that I was working on. I think they're pretty good. I'm actually surprised over how many like parts that I had, like I didn't think I had that many, uh, but I'll show you guys and uh, maybe you guys have some feedback, but I, they're not, they're not poems, they're more rhythmic, like you know when you can kind of read it in the rhythm, uh, which I am a big fan of, I like that kind of poetic kind of reading experience, uh, but I might edit it into being poems. So please ignore any um, spelling mistakes or anything, but it seems like I did try to write it before. So these ones are like the old ones. But then I made this. these parts were actually, there's quite a few and I want to have one poem per, per page, so per illustration. Um, so what is a kettle cat you ask? Oh child, they are loveliest things, let me try and explain. A kettle cat is a companion with tea and cake on a rainy afternoon with a friend or alone. A kettle cat is beautiful, they come in all shapes and sizes, with flowers and swirls, maybe a sweater or a tiny top hat. <laughs> I just came up with that, I just needed to put it in. Um, kettle cats are. are, 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 are a kettle cat is mischievous, like any cat will be. They climb all over you culturally and hide in your cupboard, even in your bed. Yeah, I definitely need to edit these, but I like the idea per um, per uh, part, poem, I don't know. They are particular, these kettle cats, that need everything to be in their place. To be honest, they are quite independent. It is their cup kittens you should be aware of. Oh, what ruckus they can cause. Smashing plates, breaking cups, those cup kittens will never have enough. By the time the evening falls and the house goes to sleep, the kittens and the cats are... I think I was trying to write like they're all tucked away in the cupboard or something. But I'll have to look them. Hmm, yeah. So I'm definitely gonna um, edit it, but I, I'm not, like, I don't hate it. Like, I quite like it, even though it's very rough. Like, I definitely didn't spend too much time in it, because I'm pretty sure I was sitting at the cafe and I was trying to write Snowcat Prince and I ended up writing this instead. <laughs> Alright, I've set up everything ready to stream. Well, not stream actually. <laughs> to So I'm going to do the tutorial now and uh, that's going to be great. I think... Where's my glove? Yeah, I just have to figure out everything. Um, make sure that I know what I'm doing. And yeah. A lot of people are asking me how I pose the animals and how I'm familiar with how they, their anatomy works. Uh, 
All right, so I did that. I'm not going to show anything that I did. I actually had trouble with it, and I I shortened it up so it's not. I'm not posing that much. I'm more under showing them how I understand anatomy on animals. So hopefully they'll be okay with that. Um, I think a posing will be in a different video. Anyway, um, I just it's very easy to edit. Like I kind of keep it very how I filmed it. So I put that in. The sound is okay. The only thing that I didn't notice before is that when I draw on the screen, it actually clicks and you can hear it like tick, 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 tick. I'm like, oh, well, I can't really remove that. The people just have to live with that, I guess. Anyway, uh, I'm exporting that now. I'm going to get some breakfast. Uh, it's currently half past ten, so I'm going to eat something and then um, chill a little bit. And then I probably will be streaming, maybe? Do some more snow cat. This is kind of my goal today, was to get this tutorial done, and I've done that, so, uh, checkbox, productivity, yes, that's my computer being very loud. I'm gonna get some, I still have waffle mixture, so I'm gonna have another waffle. I thought I had more of it left, but I only had enough for, like, a tiny one. Good morning, it's the next day, it's Thursday currently, and, uh, around, around... 9.30 <laughs> So today I actually messed up my rhythm of the yesterday and the day before uh, Because then I got up when my body got up, uh, but today For some reason I wanted to get up at 6 again, and I was like nah, I want to sleep But then I went back to sleep, and now I feel super rough And it's very annoying because like my head's heavy uh, And it's just so annoying because like the last few days have been so productive and so great because I've been getting up early enough I think so now I'm just like kind of <laughs> half awake. Um, I did spend the morning packaging orders though, so those are shipped out. And I'm going to, yeah, I got some coffee from the cafe and the a scone, so I will have that now. And the weather is really, really nice, so I'm thinking I'm gonna sit out in the, in the back courtyard garden area and sketch a bit because I just wanna sit outside, I want the air. So I'm gonna take you guys with me and I'm just gonna sit and eat. <laughs> Somebody's watching me. <laughs> the cute husky pup was watching me for like an hour <laughs> and he laid down I just kept like peeking up just to check that I was still there and then when I left he just freaked out and started barking he was like where did she go like, hopefully I get an opportunity to say hi to the owners at some point and maybe I can dog sit like I'm here all day I can I can dog sit a very cute husky pup I don't mind that at all <laughs> I used to have an Alaska Malamut like our family used to have one and he was giant, and I'm kind of used to wolfy dogs like that, so I don't know, maybe they will let me. So, like, I look like a mess today, I'm just really tired. Um, I'm going to hang up my clothes, and then I need to figure out what to do for tomorrow's video. I think maybe I'll just uh, go ahead and do a comic page, so I will just film as well as um, stream the creating of a comic book, and then uh, hopefully... That's cool enough for the... Oh, for the thing, what, what am I trying to say? Um, for a video.
because that's what I'm interested in this week. I don't really want to do anything else. If I'm doing anything else, it would be pushing myself to do something I don't really want to do. So I'm not going to do that. Uh, I am going to do a podcast at some point, but right now I'm too sleepy. So probably not right now. But yeah, clothes first. So I know this vlog is definitely not very good because I have not filmed that much. I might film a little bit tomorrow, but uh, you haven't gotten much. And I know that, and I think it's because it's just been a weird week. I've had a lot of fun, like I've streamed, like even today I streamed like four hours, and uh, I've been having a lot of fun with that. I just I guess when I stream, there's no way I can vlog, and when I get up really early, I do a lot of things um, before I start vlogging because my boyfriend's home. I might start sketching some kettle cat scenes sketches tomorrow, and I can film that. But other than that, I need to figure out what what the Friday video is because uh, I did work on the page today and it's recorded all of it. So I'm hoping that will be the video, but at the same time, I might come up with something else. I don't know, but now I'm going to pole anyway, and I'm gonna chill. And the sun is out still, so I'm very excited about biking. And yeah, I have a track package, I need to get that and sort it as well, so I'll see you tomorrow, I'm guessing. Good morning, it's one of those days where I actually film on the Friday, <laughs> because I feel like I don't have enough things uh, filmed throughout the week. But I started this day um, as I did last, well, was it Tuesday and Wednesday, I was waking up when my body woke up. And I didn't do that yesterday, and I felt so groggy the whole day, so today... I got up when my body woke up and I was six again! Woohoo! I think it's because I get to bed pretty early, so that's probably what happens. Uh, I also washed my hair and everything's kind of everywhere. And uh, yeah, so that's great. But that means also that I actually managed to wake up my boyfriend a little bit and he was like trying to do the same thing I was doing, where when he wakes up, he gets up. And suddenly we had a lot of time, so we went to the cafe and we had. A coffee and a breakfast before he took an uber to work and that was really nice i'm really happy that we could do that I think we've never done that before him going to work before and the fact that we were both up so early we just <laughs> really really helped really worked so it's really nice um i am going to finish off the page that i started yesterday for friday's video which you've already seen i think i hope <laughs> I'm going to finish that page off because I don't think I'm so close to finishing it and why not just finish it and then do something else next week. Like I was thinking of maybe today do a um a draw with me video or something like that. Like watercolor again, but this I've been I've done watercolor for the last 3 videos, so I think doing one digital is fine. So I'm just going to finish doing the art, which will take me like an hour-ish. And then, uh, yeah, I'll edit it and I'll upload it. And then I'm going to party this evening, which is going to be cool. Um, but yeah, no, I'm going to just finish that, edit that, and then I will do... I might do something else after that. I almost spoke Norwegian there <laughs> at the bar. <laughs> I'm not feeling good today. I'm I'm not too groggy, and I think really it does help to get up when you first wake up because I love sleeping and I would easily just go back to sleep. But trying to keep myself awake. Anyway, I got my coffee. I got my glasses, which kind of block out the light, the blue light. But also they're yellow, so I actually bought a new new pair of um, screen glasses, and they're pink. And I'm hoping that they don't have that that much of a yellow tint to them. They don't look like they do, so hopefully they're better. Uh, and these ones are like tiny, so they kind of make my eyes hurt because they just cover my eyes. Anyway, it doesn't really matter. Uh, the weather's really nice again today, so I kind of like half tempted to sit outside a little bit. But I'll maybe do that in the afternoon when it's a little bit warmer and I'll just finish everything that I need to do first. Yeah, I'll see you guys then. Right. Okay, so I finished the page. I am pretty happy with it. I was, I knew it was going to be one of my favorites. Um, 
just because uh, I had this image in my head since I started writing Snow Cat Prince, or, or like at least when I started like finessing the idea of the horizons. Um, so there's like three horizons in the, their world. So you have the snow horizon where the Snow Cat Prince is from, and you have the middle one which is like lush and stuff, and your last one which is more like dry and more like desert like. And um, the paths, the borders between the those extreme different horizons are quite vibrant, like like quite um, dramatic. So this is like on their way to the dramatic, dramatic <laughs> part uh, of the border of the second horizon. This they came from the first one, they're going to the second, and then they're. The third one is kind of like the last one. So um, I'm pretty happy with how this is turning out, like all the purple heathers, uh, and I've kind of edited their colors to kind of fit better with it. And uh, yeah, no, I really like it. So now I'm going to edit the um, the video. It needs to go up today, so I need to edit it and do a voiceover and just get that done so I can do something else. Yeah, um, okay. Now you can go and live your life and enjoy your beauty. Okay? You're not spiders that pick themselves, baby. Alright, it's only. Oh, I'm trying to lean this on there, but I know it won't work. Um, it's almost quarter. Well, it's quarter to 12, so it's almost 12. And I finished editing the video. The nice thing about digital videos is that they're very, very easy to and quickly to edit together. And uh, yeah, I also did the podcast for my Patreon, so that's about a half an hour long podcast. And uh, yeah, I'm just gonna put some, slap some uh, music on this one and uh, upload it and I'm good to go. I'm very happy about that. God, it's, it's nice having an early start. I do notice that because if I started later, I wouldn't have been done with this before later. So I'm gonna, I have some orders to package, I thought that would be nice to kind of get out of the way before the weekend, so they don't have to wait until Monday to get their package shipped. So I'll do that, and then uh, I think maybe I'll do some, um, just watercolor study in my sketchbook, I just feel like doing some watercolor studies right now, and I think I'll just put that on stream as well, so I can have some fun. Oh hey look, I got my postcards, I was hoping that they would come. So I could show you guys. Yes, they look so good. And this should have a shimmer as well. Okay, I'm gonna get them out of the plastic. I'm always nervous when I get postcards printed on these kind of special papers. Um, it's so much fun, but also the... I feel like the, uh, the rate of sometimes the, the fail prints can be a lot. and That's not fun. Um, gosh, come on. Oh, I love this paper. This is called the Ice Cold Paper. If you don't know where I print that stuff, it's here, printed.com. Um, and they do like super cheap stuff and also has so many different paper textures. And I love it. I especially love printing on the uh, the watercolor texture ones. Yeah, let's just hope there is no... I feel like it's a bit blurry. But I think that's just my scan. I was trying to sharpen it up, but it was a little bit hard. Let me see if I can see the. Can you see the shimmer? Let me see if I can show you the shimmer. Let's see if I can focus on this. Focus. I think you can kind of, kind of see it. It has like, when you see it in person, it has like speckles of little shimmers. Especially you can see it in the in the white, I think. They have different ones with different kind of shimmer to them. This one is the one that's called Ice Gold because I think the the paper is very white, but the glitter is kind of goldish. You can you can see it in person. It's really hard to show on camera, <laughs> but they seem pretty damn good. I was hoping my trading card was come as well, but I think they'll come tomorrow. Um, so I'll do that. But I'm very happy. They look okay too. I don't think I can see any banding. I had a few issues a few months 
where they kept sending me banded ones. And but since I messaged them, were like, "Hey, can you stop doing this?" They have actually stopped, and it's great. So many of them. Let's see. You can kind of see it better like that, actually. Let's see how many I got. I think this is. Wait, no, I did order a hundred, didn't I? Forget that I started ordering a hundred now, because you guys are so many. Like, I think I have to send out 75 this month. It's quite crazy. Alright, it seems like they only gave me four extra. Usually, I get more, but that's good. Um, it doesn't really matter, because I think there's about 75 people in that tier right now. And I ordered 100, so I guess I got 104. Um, usually they always send you extra, and I think that's just because when you print out on the big sheet and they cut it up, they have to, like, if you order 100, they might have to do 104 because that's how many fits on, like, a big sheet of printing paper. I think that's how usually how it goes. But I'm happy. I'm very, very happy with all these. They look gorgeous. And I think my patrons will like them, and the colors are amazing. So we're good. I think, you know what, I know I'm probably going to film a bit more anyway for the vlog, but I think this is a very good, no way, I, I, I was going to say it's a very good time to start showing the um, bridge to talk about the featured artist that, from my Patreon who also did the same thing. There we go. My god, that was hard to pull those words out of my head. <laughs> so we have this thing every month for my patrons where they do the same theme as I do for my pod postcards but I will show it on a vlog and I will show it but I gave them some extra days because they were some some of them were stressing about finishing it some I, I've given them to until tomorrow so I will I will do that then but that will be at the end of the vlog and it won't be with my face or anything so um it doesn't really matter anyway I pretty much I just need to post the podcast that I did and then I think I'm just gonna set up for a traditional sketchbook stream I think that will be the rest of my day and I will film that from an angle because I like doing that and then you will get some speed paint at the end of this very weird kind of sporadic vlog uh, but all right I'm gonna do that That was a really nice stream, I had a really nice time, but now I have to uh, get going because I'm going to have dinner out with people that I know and it's going to be nice. Uh, but yeah, I, I had a lot of fun with the sketches. I did a caracal as well and also an environment. I, didn't, I don't like the environment, but I like filling up the sketchbook with something else than just people and animals. So There you go, that's what I did on stream. I think from now on Friday is going to be like a sketchbook stream where I just have fun with watercolors and stuff. So if you want to see that, you can do that. And uh, yeah, I'm just going to add this, end this vlog here. Um, I will do a little, what's it called? Feature of my people on Patreon who's done their little postcards theme. And I will do that as a voiceover though, so you'll see that in a second. But yeah, I'll end this vlog and I'll see you next week. Oh boy! And as I mentioned, I will be doing a little feature of my wonderful patrons who has also entered into the monthly postcard 
theme, which was the land of stars and shadows. And oh my god, so many more people joined this time, and they're all insanely amazing. I can't, I, I don't, I don't have words for how creative all these guys are. There's so many new patrons and so many new faces, and so many decided to join in on the little challenge. And I'm so happy they did, and I'm excited to do it next month as well. And um, I can't express how much they support me and how much I love them. So I really hope they will stay and I will stay supporting them. And please go check out their Instagrams or other handles. I think there's some Tumblrs and some Divan are in there as well. And go check them out and give them some love because they're absolutely insanely amazing and talented and creative. And I don't, I should have done their their ideas because they're better than me or <laughs> they work well, better with the theme that I did. <laughs> Anyway, have a lovely day everyone. It is the end of the video and I will see you next week. Bye bye!